Hi and welcome. <clears throat> Tonight I wanted to actually just um, do a bit of a, a reading or of, of a card or two and I wanted to also um, embrace <clears throat> the new um, Osiris oils as well that I have um, brought to fruition. Basically, um, the Osiris oil, the Osiris god, he basically um, was the god of transformation as he was put together by his wife Isis um, and resurrected or rebirthed. Um, so I think this time after the Lion's Gate, it was a massive, felt like a massive rebirth and um and just shifting and removing things and i've been doing lots of cleaning lately which has been feeling really good and sort of decluttering and that's been feeling very good um as well and sort of just you know bringing things through um and just really trusting uh, and trusting is a big thing and i think <clears throat> the more that we trust ourselves and we trust things um and 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 the more things come to us um the more we allow it to come um and you know i think this is going to be a really good um time and um we just have to remove the fear and do it like remove all the fears that we have um you know to, um step by step um, I think that's, for me, that's probably been, uh, the biggest one, sort of removing my fear of even doing videos, <laughs> um, you know, sort of being in front and actually, you know, um, being in front and being myself, which is, you know, I can't be somebody else. I have to be me. So, um, you know, I welcome all of you to be who you are and to show up um who you really are and you know let's just celebrate and you know enjoy ourselves and um and let's see what what else can come from this so <clears throat> first of all i'm just going to do a little bit of an anointing so um if you want to join me just even just close your eyes and just take a deep breath so breathing in through your nose and just breathing out whatever's whatever's been happening today, um, whatever it is, just allow it to just just settle and be calm and take another deep breath. So breathing in through the nose. And breathing out. And just a few more times, breathing in. And breathing out. And then when you're ready to open your eyes, even if you have some oil at home, uh, it, you know, I think the intention and what you and how you use it is the most important thing. Um, and the intention and the love and, and the care and, you know, even affirmations, you can even put affirmations um, and, you know, put the sound, put a sound cleaning, healing on. Um, I downloaded an app called the Solfeggio, which is, I think, eight, eight different frequencies. Um, and the frequency of 528 is absolutely amazing. Apparently, it helps to um, regenerate and repair our DNA. Um, so I've been, I've been playing that a lot, um, and it's been amazing. I absolutely love it. Um, so now I'm just going to, I actually placed my oil in a, an Egyptian perfume bottle. I uh, really love these bottles. They're just really beautiful. So I'm just going to close my eyes. Okay. 
and I'm just going to um, bring the bottle up to my nose and just take a breath with her. And then I'm going to start placing it where I feel that um, I need this oil. I'm just going to softly rub it in <clears throat> okay now I just felt um, like sharing I'm using the um, Isis cards by Alana Fairchild I absolutely love these cards I think they're amazing <clears throat> so I'm going to do uh, whatever whatever comes through pretty much um, so yeah so I'm just gonna shuffle the cards <laughs> What one if a card comes out, <laughs> falls out? Okay, all right, we have one card. <sighs> okay, this card is the Pyramid of Light. And uh, what it says on the card, premium of light, step into you, step your vibration deeper into love. Um, I feel this today is, um, I feel that there's like four quadrants and what's going to happen is people are going to, um, it's like the four, it's like the four directions. Uh, you know, you know, in each sort of different different um, um, uh, medicine wheels. <laughs> Excuse me. Um, it's like people are going to be stepping into one of those, and they're going to really, um, basically, really bring out aspects of that direction. Uh, whatever they've been, whatever they've uh, resonate with, and um, I think that is really truly from their heart what's going to step out and either they're going to be stepping into uh, aspects of that direction or they're going to be um i see a lot of like a lot of this sort of like painting <clears throat> um, i see a lot of painting a lot of people like really um being free feeling like they're free uh dancing um so it's like a create the creative expression but I see a lot of a lot of light coming out through people's third eye. Um, it's almost so it, it does actually remind me of this of this part here, and also obviously the uh, the Wajet, which is the eye of Horus. You know, the 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 eye basically it's like these arms are coming out. It's like it's almost like we as a collective we just this is what we need to do. This is what this is basically us as um as the collective as people as love as souls that we need to come to really come together and really um shine our true light and um and also i'm telling myself this message too <laughs> um <laughs> basically this is what you know uh, we you us um this is what we we need to do 
and um, this pyramid of light basically it's a stable grounding a stable ground for us to then shoot up so we can you know in order to be in order to shoot up you need to be grounded so um, we always need to you know walk along grass um, go and you know and do things that are grounding, like eat grounding foods, you know, vegetables that are grown, you know, like potatoes, sweet potatoes, carrots, um, eat, eat more foods for our eyes. Um, so like, you know, the, the, the carotene colors, the orange colors, um, uh, and there's like, um, fire. So like obviously it's like the, the flames, you know, the three flames, the three different color flames. I, at the moment, the colors, I think it's red, red, blue, and white. Was it yellow? Um, <clears throat> at the moment, I, I, I don't remember, but I, it kept on, keeps on saying flames. These flames, basically the three flames. So it's like our twins. And then there's the, the twins and then there's one in the middle so the one in the middle is actually our true selves the other two are just aspects so the divine masculine and the feminine and then it's like the when they all when they all just merge it's like we become this one light being and then from that everything just exudes like this whole flames just yeah <coughs> so um i might do one more cut Okay, <laughs> we have three cards, but I'll get one. The first one that came out. Okay, we have the Eye of Horus, the Wajet, my my <laughs> most popular design that I like to do on my hair tattoo. Um, the Eye of Horus, basically, um, he, the Wajet. And the eye of Horus, basically that's what it means, um, in, in, in like hieroglyph language. The eye of Horus is basically what we perceive in the future and we perceive in the past and we see perceive on like the sides of us and everything just sort of comes together. So it's like we... We have just brought all these things together and they're all just, it's like the front of us, the back of us, the side of us, the top of us and the below us. Also, the eyes, the eyes have it pretty much. see <laughs> anyway thank you very much for um being here with me and i hope you have a beautiful night and a beautiful day and uh, we'll see you next time thank you